You all wanted to know the connection between consuming salt and hypermobility. The reference to consuming a lot of salt in our Life with Hypermobility post, many of those things are not going to apply to every single person. Hypermobility is a spectrum and people are impacted differently by it. A lot of you asked though about the association with salt. So this is actually in relation to a commonly co-occurring condition that is often found alongside hypermobility called dysautonomia. The most commonly referred to type of dysautonomia is POTS or postural orthostatic tachycardic syndrome. And part of dealing with the symptoms of POTS is making sure that you have adequate hydration. That's, we always have a giant water bottle with us. And along with that is consuming enough sodium so that you are increasing your blood volume and that helps with the symptoms of dysautonomia and POTS, things like dizziness and rapid heart rate and fatigue, etc. So these are our favorite ways of consuming. These are element packets. They